Good morning. Hector had an early meeting today, so it's just the boys and I making some German pancakes. We're about to sit down and eat, and then I will chat with you. Hey guys, I'm gonna have a little sit down time, give you an update on things around here. <laughs> I have been contemplating what I'm gonna do for school because of our move and the school year being like exactly at the same time. And you know, I did some homeschool prep videos where I shared everything leading up to being totally ready for school and then all of a sudden we are moving and it's gonna land like literally two weeks after school is supposed to start and so I just haven't really uh, I've been thinking a lot about what should I do for school? Should I just not do anything until we're there? Should I do a little bit before up it once we're there and settled? I feel like I finally decided I think that I will feel best if this is our last week of summer break. We have the weekend and we start school officially on Monday and make it a solid, real school week just to get a little feel for what this year is going to feel like, look like. And then the following week, do the minimum, just maybe English and grammar and math, and then start packing and then the following week same thing and then maybe at bedtime read some history or geography but nothing major no pressure just whatever we can read together for fun in the other subjects and then the following week we actually be moving and then once we're there and settled not necessarily all unpacked but at least the kitchen settled maybe the beds and the classroom <laughs> I can start my full normal school year and just gradually in the afternoons unpack and get settled in. So that's what I'm thinking. But I'm also holding on to that very loosely because I don't know what to expect. Anything could happen between now and closing. Anything could happen between now and Monday. So I am just going to take it a day at a time, have grace on myself and know that the school year will officially start soon <laughs> um just not 100 percent sure how or when uh that will look so that's one thing the other stuff going on around here is really just enjoying our last week of summer break yesterday we had adventure day which was so fun my friend homeschool mom of seven has property and she does field day for us there and then her son likes to uh, do these adventure days once a year where he invites certain boys from an age from a certain age and and up to come over and do some cool survival things and uh, obstacle course and then they just have free play after eating lunch with in the pond kayaking running around the woods whatever and my goodness my kids had the best time and i'm so thankful that that was part of our last week of summer break such a fun way to end the the summer break so that's pretty much what this week looked like we had a lot of fun playtime friend time um we did housework together and just trying to rein in the structure again getting ready for the school year getting chores really down bedtime down getting reading aloud down back into our regular normal part of routine uh when the days are so long it's easy to let bedtime be later and later and it's summer it's fine but i definitely like my evening time and my morning time by myself and so i really enjoy I really like to have the kids in bed relaxing and just having even for themselves time to themselves to read or 
um, just relax in bed and think around nine is when I turn lights out and um, then I can go and do my stuff. And this morning I woke up early and um, it's kind of funny, the dog is growing up. So he's probably like 17 or 18 weeks now and he, instead of just going outside at six in the morning, peeing and coming back in, he like roams. So I have to put the leash on him now. So this morning at six in the morning I was walking, which is fine, but it's not the best feeling to like roll out of bed, put a leash on a dog and go for a walk. <laughs> I'm like, what? What in the world? I just got up. So it's nice though because once we come in, he comes straight to the sofa and I can read and pray and drink my coffee while he sleeps. But the walking at that time is new. It's okay. And today's been pretty productive. We have a play date in a little bit, but I got to clean the bathrooms and clean the kitchen and tidy up and work out and do laundry. I'm washing the boys' sheets today. And um, yeah, it's been a productive day. It's been good. So I am now gonna wrap up my videos, go to my friend's house. I wanna get back. All I have to do is make dinner. So it's been a nice day and always nice chatting with you guys. So thanks for watching. Thank you to all my patrons and God bless you guys. See you next time.